Noble One, this is Noble Actual. Noble One, go ahead. We need that base taken out, son. What's your status? Still outside. Thermal on the interior show standing room only. We're gonna have to send them out or we'll be way too popular. Copy that, Noble One. Holland down. We got a job to do, so let's stay focused and get it done. Six, are you in position? Affirmative. Good. Execute. All right, hey guys, and welcome Contact back. Contact owns this sector now, but they're defending for a major strike, not a small group infiltration. Eliminate all hostile ground to air defenses so the rest of Noble can land at Sword Base for the torch and burn. Keep a low profile. If we take them by surprise, this will be a hell of a lot easier. Torch and burn, eh? Welcome back to Halo Reach, everybody. Right, let's get cracking. So, we've had a bit of an escapade uh, so far. Looks like we are losing this conflict. We've got turrets being pinned down by turrets, which is not a fantastic position to be in. Let's try and get some cover. Alright, that should do. Luckily, that turret's having a bit of trouble actually getting a bead on us, which is nice. Let's just remove the armor on the side and send that grunt to his grave. Okay. Let's keep moving. Looks like we've got some guys on with us here. Another turret there, which is not fantastic. Ah, uh, come on. Ah, oh, bastards. Okay, that's fine. Ooh, hello. I was just singeing my shields. Fuck, they got a ghost as well. Uh, yeah, this could get delicate. We have some seemingly ODST looking guys for some backup, but I don't think they're gonna last if you catch my drift. Come on, let's take. Yes. Right, I want that ghost. I want that ghost. We need the firepower to crack this, I think. Uh, oh, yeah, we've got beam rifles up top, too. Fucking kid, yeah. Get the fuck out of here. Oh, hey, friend. Looks like you have a fuel rod. Do I want a fuel rod? Do we want a fuel rod? Maybe we want a fuel rod. Let's continue picking these grunts off. Oh, hit them right in the methane pack. And we're almost out of rounds. Cab was right. He does seem like overkill. Sending us back here for a simple demo up. Only thinks it's worth it. Want to tell you something? He tells me things ain't so simple. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it looks like these guys are getting a little bit nervous that they've got a Spartan to do this job. I don't blame them. Right, let's have a little look inside here. Nice, we've got some yeah, got some ammo, cool. I'd rather have the DMR, to be honest. Got some dead troops. Now, there was some uh, over here. There was some armor power-ups. But, hey, I kind of like the sprint in this game, to be honest. Those guys are literally fucking off over the sunset. That's fine. I'm going to take my ghost. I like my ghost. Right, chaps, if you... Ooh! Yes. Yes, it does. Let's take this out first. One does simply not pass up the uh, opportunity to roll in with a scorpion. Oh, hell yeah. Got a good amount of dudes as well on board. Nice. Okay. Rolling thunder all over again. Uh, scorpion, if you would uh, like to align, please. Thank. Alright, I guess it just... Doesn't fancy going in the direction you'd hope it would. Alright. Oh, God. Yeah, I see it. We got him. We got him. Stay frosty, guys. You need covering fire. Dude, just sitting on a scorpion. Alright. There we go. I love in Reach, they added the autoloader mechanism as well, which you can see the back of the turret when you fire a shell really cool I actually um, really like the effect in Halo 5 as well 
here. We're going to hit it. Yeah, in Halo 5, when you fire the Scorpion's main gun, you actually see the spent shell casing eject too, which is really cool, man. They added so... That's the thing. Like, 343 adds so many cool little details, which I'm a big fan of details. Yeah, let's take that thing out. We don't want that sneaking up behind us. I don't think it will, but... Oh, guys, guys. Right, we do have three guys on board. One's on the turret, which is nice. I do kind of miss having the coaxial mounted gun on this thing as well. It was nice to have that extra machine gun. Yeah, we're on it. We're on it. We got this. guessing we're going to have some heavy firepower. So the battle's still raging on. It's still pretty fucking intense over there. Come on. Yes, get down. Now these AA guns look pretty gnarly. Oh god, hello. Don't worry about the Banshees, guys. We got them. Mm, nothing but scrap. Take that structure out, whatever the hell that was. Come on, baby, come on. That's right, fly right into my stream of justice. There we go. All right, not bad, guys, not bad. <coughs> Let's push up a little bit at a time. Ooh, looks like we've got an enemy armor depot going on here. You should have a good angle, dude. If it moves, shred it. Now, can we just fire into the back of these? Should be able to. If we can get further down. Should be able to just shell inside the... Yeah, he's gone. Love the effect when these things go up. Actually, we might have to get the second one. Because they're not going to send in an airstrike. <coughs> if one of the guns is still going. So... I mean, the UNSC certainly has some moronic commanders. Oh, I don't think it's quite out of action. I don't think we can actually destroy them any other way. I think we actually, yeah, we definitely have to take the... the main turret system offline. That'll do. Hell of a splash damage on these things. Alright, that one's dealt with. This one's still active, apparently. Send some shells through. Whoa, she's gone. She's gone. Alright. Don't want to get hit by that flaming wreckage. No, sir. Alright, well, the bucket is as. Oh, Christ. This is a bit awkward. Out. That's as awkward as it gets. Right. I don't know what the hell he's firing at, to be honest. Just seems to be going crazy. Yeah. Reach is a bit of a lost cause at this point, to be honest. Whoa, there she goes. You can see their little command structure is uh, falling apart now. We are really stuck. We are really stuck here. Suicide Grunt. Don't want none of his business. Jeez. Right, let's move. We need to relocate. Interesting that the AI is programmed to attack. That gun emplacement, to be honest. Even if it's dead. Alright, let's help those Falcons out. Just a little bit. Right, let's roll. Suit and booted, guys. We're off. Keep this party train going. All these fusion coils everywhere. I guess that's to reload the guns. I'm not sure. 66 tons of pure, unadulterated fun. Don't want to leave any of their contraptions behind us. Uh, we're stuck. We're stuck on wreckage. I guess that's what happens when you have four independent tracks. Can we move that? 
Yeah, kind of. <clears throat> It'll have to do. We're really stuck on something. This, this scorpion is not having a good time. I don't know why. You can usually drive these things over anything and everything. Never had an issue in one of these before. Right, that's more like it. Let's go. Leave that falcon behind. Really? Really missing cat, yeah. Cat, unfortunately, finished before us in the human race in the last video. Which sucks. Because Noble Team are really cool. So that's Cat and George gone. This is starting to go pretty badly. Let's just say that. <clears throat> when Spartans start dying, that's bad. That's really bad. <clears throat> okay. Oh, we've got a lot of enemy armor here and a lot of emplacements. Holy crap. Look at that. They're putting up a hell of a fire net here. Oh, God. Incoming fuel rods. As I said, the fuel rods really do track you well in this game. They do seem to have very slight homing abilities too, which is a little bit cheeky, but that's just the way it is. Alright, let's keep these skies clear. So it appears that our falcons are having a little bit of trouble keeping these skies clear. Come on, baby. Glad we didn't have to fight through this on foot. That would have been a bit iffy, to say the least. Alright, here we are, finally at sword base. Look at this shit, man. Ooh. Yeah, I can tell. You know it's bad when the enemy's uh, reinforcing the outside of the base. Oh, man. Well, we've still got some guys left. I thought I heard a fuel rod. Get out of here, dude. Alright, how are we looking? Got that falcon there. That falcon really didn't help us much, did it? Huh. Okay, really getting some trouble turning this this thing round. I don't know why. <laughs> Vehicles in Halo, like, the control system is strange, but once you're used to it, they actually control really well. That one must have just been a bit iffy. Right, unfortunately, we've got to leave the uh, scorpion behind. Is, is there any gear around here? Right, here we go. This is where things are going to get a little bit more delicate. We don't have a lot for the assault rifle either, which, well, I'm sure we can sort that out. Hello, Mr. Elite. Do I have any presents for you? I actually do. Oh, God. These Elites have some serious shielding. Oh, Christ. Right, Carter and all the rest of the guys are over there, but I look at things. Which is fine. Come on, baby, come on. Take those rounds like a champion. That's it. Really? Stupid grunt. Getting pushed back by a grunt. You know things are going south when you've got a grunt. We could really use Fred and Linda here. Now there, Spartans. Oof. Right. Some good heavy rounds on him. There we go. Sometimes the charge works. Oh, hey, friend. Get out of here, dude. Right. How's it going, guys? Glad to see you made it. Okay, cool. I guess we're going inside. Is there no gear out here? Oh, there's a med kit. I don't really care too much. Oh, shotgun. Yeah, I guess if we're going inside, shotgun's probably where it's at. Anything else? Well, that guy didn't make it off the landing pad. Oh, man. No weapon lockers or anything out here? 
I guess we're doing our bit to destroy the base. Alright, let's head inside. There'll be weapon lockers and stuff inside, but I thought there would have been something nice out here. Don't know where our marines have gone, because they're still alive, but hey. We've got aliens out here somewhere. I can hear them. Hey, friend. Yeah, nice try. You know what? Have that. That'll do, Donkey. That'll do. Office of Naval Intelligence. Man, this place is uh, kind of gone to hell. Jesus. All right. Yeah. This place has been melted. Look, they've really reinforced this thing. Oh, dude. Alright, so uh, the data pad actually should be here somewhere, I think. Some more ammo. Lovely. Now, if I was a data pad, where would I be? I'm sure it's in here somewhere. Mm. Right. Yeah, maybe it's a little bit further on. It's been a while since I've got the data pads. Yeah, it might be further on, I guess. I'm not going to worry too much about them. Just because um, I don't really add anything to the story. And unless you're really ingrained into the Halo Halo lore. They don't really matter too much. Another shotgun. Lovely. Ooh. Armor lock up. Right. I guess I'm going to have to fill in for George with the heavy weapons for now. Fried those guys. How's it going, boys? We've got uh, yeah, we ain't got anything that useful here. All these guys have armor lock. That's interesting. Okay. At least we can jump with these plasma turrets. Right, let's go. Ooh, we've got a sword. Sword is nice for close encounters. But the sword usually gets you killed. If you're not too careful. Right, let's keep pushing these guys back. Can we actually go back? I'm curious. Can we actually go back to where we came in? Guess we can't. Alright. Fair enough. We're gonna keep pushing. I think the data pads, really, to be honest, out of uh, out of all the terminals that you got in, whoa, out of all the terminals and whatnot that you got in the other games, the data pads were really not as interesting. I think. But we're just gonna keep making our way up. Come on, guys, you can hide behind me if you like. Would kind of prefer if you kept pace with me. Really? Dude. Seriously. That's just enough of your bullshit. Alright, let's grab some stuff. At least there is actually shotgun ammo here, I think. Yeah, there's one shotgun there, so... I don't know why there's only one shotgun in the rack. I see no movement. Nope, nothing here. They've removed the shotgun from Halo Infinite, apparently, as well. And they've added a new shotgun, <coughs> an automatic shotgun, into Halo for the first time. Which, I'm actually quite into that, to be honest. Because it's, it's going to be interesting to see a nice new high-tech shotgun. Oh man, look at this place. Oh. 
proceed to the coordinates. At least we've got a checkpoint from the checkpoint gods. Maybe it's around here somewhere actually. The data pad. I like the way weapons are kind of highlighted in the night vision. That's a nice little touch actually. Alright, let's go grab some guns, ammo, and lovely. Now that is a door. Yep, we're on it. We're on it. Oh god, we've got some heavy fighting in here. Got some invisible elites too. Oh, tagged him. Yes, tag the bastard. That's what we like. Come on. Get him whilst the shields are weak. There we go. That's what we're talking about. Get some nades out there. When in doubt, get the frags out, my friends. That's what we do. You alright, buddy? How do you think of that? Welcome to Reach. Oh, God. Does that mean that... Yes. Whoa. <laughs> What happened there? Ah, right. Yes, of course. What would there be? What would there be? Bloody concussion rifle. Ah, the concussion rifle. Ah, oh, it sucks. Oh, it sucks. Right. Let's push up, my friends. Let's pop a grenade in there. And flush the fucker out of here. Yeah, you don't like that, do you? Ooh, right in the throat. Get fucked. Alright, not bad. Ooh. Damn, that's all that's left of an engineer. Delicious. I hear they taste like chicken. Apparently the grunties taste like lobster. Alright, well, it doesn't look like there's much here. Oh, man, look at this place. Trashed. Warning, security breach. Yeah, you think? My God. This place was once, like, a fortress. An absolute impenetrable fortress. Look at it now. Covenant shit all over the place. My god. Ugh. Now, if I was a data pad. Sure. I don't think it's here. Pretty sure we've missed the data pad. I'll have to get it after the level. That's fine. Damn it. Uh, hmm. Oh! <laughs> Fuck's sake. I thought, I really did think it was downstairs. I, I could, I remembered pushing a button. Uh, they don't have hearts or souls, but they know what we want. And what we need, but they don't love us. How can you love without a heart or a soul? Uh, did you call out to them? Why would I do that? The reasons are currently not the focus of this line of inquiry now. Did you call out to them? What reason would I have to do that? Uh, as has already been stated, your motives are not relevant at this time. Did you call out to them? This tribunal already has all the evidence needed to discern the answer on its own. If that were true, this tribunal would not have been convened. Again, did you call out to them? Why would I have why would you have called out to them? Your counter query is irrelevant. This tribunal demands an answer. Reply to the counter query and you will have your answer. It is the opinion of this tribunal that the possibility of a non-optimal outcome would have been too great. Are you certain this is disturbing? Perhaps more recent data has altered your perception. If you would let me confer with my old committee, no. 
It is important. It is the opinion of this tribunal that introducing an unknown factor to the creator's already precarious state would have been disadvantageous. It is now the opinion of the assembly that our creators would have been unable to stop themselves from initiating contact, even if advised against doing so. Contact with a culture of extrasolar origin is one of their longest held desires, and the minority becomes the majority. Both agree contact should have been postponed until a more advantageous point in time, indefinitely if possible. But postponing contact would only have worked to the unknown factor's advantage. Our galaxy is full of wolves. I could no longer watch our flock stumble towards their slaughter. This tribunal acknowledges your admission of guilt. Was that ever in doubt? Might I suggest a more fruitful use of cycles, such as a plan for addressing signs of rampancy in this assembly senior? Tribunal is now closed. So yeah, that was uh, discussing the fact that it was actually, I think, from from how this is worded, these guys actually uh, initiated first contact with the Covenant, uh, not the humans. I think. As I said, uh, once I've wrapped this game up, I'm going to read into this a little bit more because it's kind of interesting, but it changes a lot that we know about the halo law i don't know if this how um certified this is in the canon i'm not sure because if these ais really are surviving forever uh for hundreds of years you know rampancy is a thing although they have just mentioned it there anyway let's continue i don't know i'm very interested in this it's not as exciting to be honest, as the other uh, hidden pickups, but eh. Looks like they got themselves cornered, or were committed to the position. I'm going with cornered. There's nothing here. No load bearing columns either. Sir, if we're supposed to blow this place, this ain't the spot to do it from. Dot, so. check your vector. Vector confirmed, Commander. We are precisely where only has directed. Apologies. Coordinates revised. Please confirm. Revised? By an AI of unknown origin whose clearance is well above my own. Huh. Well, it's pointing us a click and a half east and 2,000 feet underground. I didn't do my job, Commander. Sir, I say we go AI free on this one. Obviously, these coordinates are junk and the longer we go chasing them. Are they? What is this, Dot? Our revised route, Commander. All right, we came this far. So where the hell are we going? Base is trashed. We're obviously not here to demo the place, I guess. Hmm. But who would be calling us? This is all a bit smoke and mirrors, but that's Your only for AI you. Friend tell you anything else, Dot? Dot. She's been expecting you. Ooh. That's perfect. Apologies for the unusual security measures, Commander. Uh -huh. Commander. Doctor Halsey. Casualty reports have you listed as. Yes, well, as they say, news of my death has been greatly exaggerated. I only wish the same could be said of the rest of Noble Team. We all do, ma'am. It may please you to learn that the data module Noble 2 procured from Visegrad Station contained precisely what my scientist promised. A latchkey discovery. It has unlocked, at last, the mm. secrets of this excavation. Not sure I understand. Your orders were a pretext to bring you to me and have been overridden. You are here, Team Noble, to ensure the delivery of this vital data to a secure location. Doctor, our orders are to destroy all sensitive material. Others will handle the demolition. 
I'll need a confirmed new directive with command. Colonel Holland will be briefed. You belong to Omi now. Oof. Well, Six is used to that, because Six used to belong to Oni. Before you is an alien artifact neither human nor covenant in origin, advanced beyond our comprehension until now. Thanks to Noble 2, the decrypting of its data is nearly complete. Whatever we're doing down here, we'd better do it quick. Have your data ready, ma'am. We're coming to you. The decrypting process is still underway. I don't think you understand. We're out of time. If it isn't portable when we reach you, it's gonna get buried. Bury any of it, and you bury mankind's best chance for survival. Commander, you've been wondering what your Spartans died for? They died for this. Oof. Please, buy me all the time you can. Okay. Cryptic as always, Dr. Halsley. She's the one that created Commander, the Spartan program. Already in defensive position. Only with respect and company. They sure as hell got it. Doc, we have hostiles inbound. Spartans, you cannot allow the Covenant to break through the door to my lab. Understood. Let's give the doctor the time she needs. Current objective, defend the lab. Turrets to assist you in defending the lab. Get them online and quick. Let's do it. Take too much damage, they'll shut down to recharge. You'll need to reactivate them when they come back online. Okay, that's curious human technology. Okay, let's get these things going. What other toys has Halsley got packed in here? I wonder. So we've got ATVs. Uh, we've got a Spartan laser. Yes, please. We've got a spanker. Let's see if we can do something about all these. Oh, jetpack might be nice. Mongoose would be nice, but oh god, look at them all. I need more time. Whatever you have to do, do it. Yeah, well, I'm trying to do it. Let's get these turrets online. Looks like here we go. Little fucking grunt. Well, that's not brilliant, but we'll have three of them online. Ow. Come on. Turret number three. Biggest problem is going to be these. Activate. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Oh, they're sending in brutes. They're sending in the big boys. We need to back the fuck up. We're dead. We're dead. Maybe the mongoose is the way to go for that. Charge right down. Well, we don't have a mongoose now. Let's try and get the hell out of here regroup if we can. Oh my god, these guys. Dudes, die. Seriously, die. I think we've given ourselves a really anus checkpoint, to be honest. But it's fine. We can survive. We've lost B. B's gone. Alright, guys, if you can defend this, that'd be great. I'm going to grab a mongoose and see what I can do. Oh, fuck. Right, here we go. We need turrets. We need turrets. Whoa! That was not good. That worked. Right, gun turret online. Come on. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's keep these gun turrets going as much as we can. Oh, no, we don't want that. Uh, Alright, well, we got that. Fucking jackals. Jackals in the courtyard! Ooh, the wraith? I mean, yeah, okay. Cool, on it. Ow. <sighs> Fuck. Okay, let's get some health going. Where's the wraith? Jesus. Right, give me the health. Give me the health. Got the health. 
We need some better weapons because the spiker ain't going to be up to much, that's for sure. There we go. That's what we're talking about. Let's get some hardware. Gun turrets are all still up. And I just shot one of my friends right in the face. Which is not a very friendly thing. You know, regardless of what they say. Friendly fire isn't and all that. We've got the... Wow, they really were expecting some shit here, weren't they? Come on, boys. Let's take out these bloody brutes. They're the problem right now. It's got an armor lock. That's no good. Got him. Another one coming in. Come on, guys. Hold that line. May oh, God. Dropping the hammer down pretty hard on us. Yeah, we got the job done all right, but we need to keep that going. Now, I don't know if those turrets do recharge on their own, or if they actually have to collapse to recharge. I need to take... I need to take this wraith out. This wraith is bad news. There it is. I see it. Now, what could be more fun is to actually try and grab the Wraith, but I'm not convinced that's possible at this moment. Oh, one round. Come on, how many have we got? We've got one shot left. There we go. See you later, pal. Right, turrets are still holding to a point. C's looking a little bit worse for work. That's fine. Keep going, see? These turrets aren't bad. Not bad at all. Oh, God. Hey, friend. I don't know if we have... Don't know if we have... Um, another... Spartan laser. Probably not. Very expensive piece of gear, to be honest. Only two. Oh, God, eh? It's not great. Well, troops we can handle. There is actually a trophy, I believe, involved getting a Banshee. But it really is a pain in the ass to pull off. Did I just say a trophy? I mean, achievement. Ah, oh, C's about to go dark. But we can always reset it if we need to. We got the mongooses. We just keep the pressure on these guys. Keep them away from our turrets. Oh, here we go. Shit, A's down. That's not great. Really don't want to lose these turrets because they definitely help. Whoa, see what I mean? Literally shredded that guy. Yeah, you can swear at me all you like, mate. Ain't gonna help you in the long run. Ghosts as well. Oof. It's gonna get delicate. Can't afford to lose any more turrets, really. In fact, do I want to try and get A online? Don't know how worth it that is, to be honest. Fuck it. We're gonna go. We're gonna go. Let's try and get A back online. Yep. Oh, God. <laughs> yeah, that went about uh, went about as well as I thought it would. What I would like, actually, is possibly if we can get a, a ghost. That would be a nice amount of firepower. All right, guys. Hold it together. Hold it together. It's only the Covenant against millions of Spartans. Right, we could go and snag this one. I don't know if we can get in those buildings. Right, let's go grab. Sneak down to A. Let's fire this bass back up. C, where's C? Ah. 
Come on, baby. Come on. Nope. Not happening. Not on this difficulty. I think it's just going to be way more trouble than it's worth. Although, I mean, the game's given me a checkpoint here. Oh, God. There's two of them. Whoa. Yeah, he's gone. Let's get some more rounds in there. All right, that's not A. A's... Where's A? A's over here. Okay. A's still good. Come on, turret. Come on. She's recharging. We don't need her to recharge. B's still good. Come on, A. Come on. It's tracking, but it's not actually doing anything, which is a bit interesting. A? Has it glitched? I don't know. Strange. Okay, another checkpoint. Oh, God. I think the defenses are ready. Can't really... Oh, no, that's A. What am I looking for? B... C's the one that's down. Over there. Jesus. I am a moron. But you already knew that. Come on. Oh, yeah. That's what we're talking about. That's what we're talking about, boys. Oh, my God. Whilst they're just absolutely getting railed. Like we've got another wraith over here. Come on, one round left. We can actually get this thing. Whoa, see you in hell, sunshine. Who shut down? Who shut down? This one. Okay. Let's go switch her back on. Oh, right, this one. Okay. Oh, fuck me. Where did he come from? Christ. Literally just poked me in the buttocks with his sword. You bastard. I got a special present waiting for you. Come to me, baby. Yes. Moron. Sounds like we... Ah, oh, that might actually be useful. I'm opening the laboratory door. Right. Now, we might have a nice little clear entrance in, but I'm going to take out this Wraith. Because fuck the Wraith. I mean, these things don't really do as much damage as you'd think they do. But they do enough, you know? Let's just hammer the thing. Yeah, fuel rods really don't do as much damage as the spanker to be honest so it's like it's not even close I kind of remember a mantis being out here did I dream that yeah 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 we're on it we're on it it's called exploration my dude okay I'm really missing that sprint never did like sprint being an armor power I always thought sprint should just be, you know, a feature because, you know, humans can sprint. I mean, you can run pretty quickly anyway. But sprinting, yo. Spartans can run very fast. I mean, Linda was something else. No, was it Linda or was it Kelly that could run really fast? I forget. But that's blue team anyway. That's chief Spartans. Alright, let's go through the door. It was Linda that could run fast, I think. Because she was a sniper. No, she is a sniper. She's still alive. Let's 
So's Kelly. So's Fred. Knowledge. A birthright from an ancient civilization. This AI is its custodian, and she has chosen you as her couriers. Chosen? By an AI? By this AI, yes. Her measure of you carries as much weight as my own, perhaps more. There she is. You are to take her to the UNSC shipbreaking yard in Azad. There, you'll find a Halcyon-class cruiser waiting to get her off planet. I understand. Do you? The spirit of autumn. Mankind the spirit of autumn? When Reach falls, Pillar of autumn. Our annihilation is all but certain. Unless we can glean from this artifact a defense against the Covenant. A game changer. On the level of the conical bullet in the 19th century, or faster than light travel in the 23rd. And what if we can't? An apt question, if there were somewhere else to place our hope. There is not. Take it, Lieutenant. She has made her choice. Do you have it? Yes. Say the words, please. I have it. Oof. Dr. Halsey, Noble Three will escort you to Castle Base. I require no escort, Commander. June, make sure nothing falls into enemy hands. I'll do what's necessary, sir. Good luck. You too, Rifleman. <laughs> I need a heading dot. At three kilometer north, Turn right, heading 050. Which leads to? The shipbreaking yards in Azod. The only off-planet extraction point left on this continent. Small-scale air attacks have decimated many convoys en route. An armada of Covenant cruisers is hastening to the site as well. UNSC cruiser Pillar of Autumn is awaiting your arrival. Wouldn't be a noble mission if it were easy. Amen. Well, there goes the site. Mm-hmm. The Pillar of Autumn. Right, guys. I'm going to leave it there. So, we have the package. We have the AI. Uh, <laughs> this is not your groove. Yes, who would have thought? So, we have Cortana in our back pocket. And now we need to deliver her to the Pillar of Autumn and get the fuck off reach. Hmm were it so easy anyway till next time guys till next time